know, we had no practice going in. This would be unheard of <gasps> in a normal year. And it was kind of just, okay, let's get to the field, let's walk through it, and then let's go play football. And that's uh, that's exactly what it was. But it's 2020 and Rosemount football won. Defense, hold that line. Not one, not two, but three games in an eight-day span. Uh, the grind of three games in, in a period of eight days uh, was, was hard um, and we got uh, we got three wins out of it and we feel like we're getting better. October was a calendar of chaos here at Rosemount. Their first two games were scrapped due to COVID-19 situations. Then in week three, they beat Egan, slid in Woodbury on a rare Monday night game and then capped off the stretch by knocking off Champlin Park. Plain and simple, not lose a game. and. Regardless of state, regardless of anything, I mean, we got a great group of guys. The Irish have big goals and two more games scheduled for this year. But Rosemount knows all too well to expect the unexpected. We, we have no idea what the rest of our season is going to look like. So our, you know, our goal, I guess, is to uh, just win every game that we have an opportunity to play and uh, appreciate and value that opportunity and make the most of it by giving it everything we've got. Andy McDonald, CARE 11 Sports.